Hey, it's Matt the Momo Hunter with McGee Farms and uh, gonna show a little bit of some lighting that we're doing on our new tractor. This is an LS XR 4140. Just got it about a week or so ago. I enjoy it. We live about two miles down a county gravel road and a couple times in the winter we'll get a foot of snow. Two days later we'll get another foot of snow and it takes the county a good week or two to get out here to plow and then of course now uh they're even more short-handed so they're saying it's going to be longer so now i got some heat it usually ends up being me on one of the other tractors with no cab on it freezing my butt off while it's 10 degrees so we're doing some lighting on this and if you've got one of these it comes with these lights here that are don't put out hardly any light whatsoever so i had these led lights that uh i'd had for another project i think a side by side these were left over i have them mounted it's uh just basically the bolt right here comes off these bolt right up i have uh connectors and I'll leave the link at the bottom on the description, but a uh, few connectors, you can see I got a bag of them right here. I bought them off Amazon, seven bucks for two sets of them. And they plug right in with no, no issues at all. Uh, another lighting thing that I did is with me being out plowing, I got a beacon light that I'm gonna mount up. I'll show you that, uh, or I'll leave the, uh, the link to where I got it from at Amazon. I cut a little bit of uh, just some angle iron right here. I'm gonna come back, try to paint it, but right now it's too cold to really get paint on. I don't have anywhere inside, uh, you know, to really set it and paint it. And I'm waiting on the plug. These LSs, they have right here, they have a plug in. And it's a, you just buy the plug, they're on Amazon. Again, I'll leave a link for that as well. The other lighting that I'm getting ready to do right now that just came in, like I said, these front lights, nothing. So, just got this in today, 37 inch light bar off of Amazon, LED. I'm gonna put it across the front uh, when you get these, there's two kinds. There's the kinds that mount over on the side here. Uh, you don't want to mess with those. There are, there's these other ones that they mount onto the fins. And as I put it together, you'll kind of see, and you can adjust them back and forth. With that, they'll mount right up to the brackets on the tractor. Because you can slide, you can make them wider. You just basically have to come and measure from one bracket to the other see how wide it is and uh, just get one that is at least that wide or anything pretty much wider will fit on there. So that's the start right now. I'm getting ready to pull these lights off and uh, I'm going to start mounting the light bar and then start wiring it. And so you'll see in the next video as I'm taking these down. Okay, so as I was trying to explain a little bit, the brackets you want to get for this are the type that are, they look like this. You don't want the ones that mount on the end because you want them to be able to slide back and forth. They'll have some nuts that are already in a channel. You put the screws in, that way you can adjust it so it'll hook right on to the existing brackets that were on the lights that were on the tractor before.
Okay, so we got all the lighting installed. I still need to get in and kind of tuck the wires. Uh, the connectors were some shrink wrap connectors. So also uh, need to hit that with a heat gun and just kind of shrink them a little bit. But got the light bar on front and come around back. Got these LEDs. Like I said, I still need to kind of tuck those wires in. But uh, that's kind of basically what I did. I will uh, attach uh, some of the parts and stuff and the equipment that I used to do it. But uh, hooked it up last night, turned it on after dark, and it put out a lot of light. So uh, very happy with the results. So hope you liked the video. Hope it helps you out. Uh, again, this is Matt the Momo Hunter with McGee Farms, and if this helped you, if you enjoy it, please uh, leave us a like, subscribe, maybe uh, leave a comment. It's all appreciated. Thank you.